Hello everybody. I figured I'd do an unboxing video today. I got a, a package from Jonathan Curtin of Brim Wars and I figured I'd open it up with you guys. And he sent me a whole bunch of different flies. See what all we got. Here's some test flies. They look a little bit like a crazy Charlie backstabber hybrid. That's pretty cool, actually. Couldn't show you right there. That would be a really good carp fly. He sent me a pretty awesome little midge, or a nymph, nymph pattern. A pretty cool little water spider. I may have to give that a try pretty quick. I'll test out all these. Looks like a little panfish Charlie. He's an excellent, excellent tire. I highly recommend if you buy flies, check him out. He's really good. <clears throat> he sent me a ton. I'm not. I think these little bluegill bombs. A really nice job. He did a good job on them. Pretty cool little pattern. I like the chenille and rubber leg combination. Wow. We'll just look at all those in there. I like that little crayfish. Using the little crayfish bodies and the little dub, that's gonna work actually really well. Here's another little crayfish. Another little crayfish. I'm gonna check these all out. Looks like a little peeping caddis. Really good job. Really good job. Some nice little nice little like size. Oh I'd say that's a 14. Little water spider. There's another water spider, another peeping caddis, this looks kind of like a, oh, like a mealworm variant, a little, or a big nymph, caddis larva maybe. That's a miniature super bugger right there, a little bugger. Hackle this bugger. Another caddis. Holy crud. That's a really neat hopper variant right there. I like that. I bet that's, that's going to rock out. He does awesome, awesome work. I've known him quite a while now, and he really does a good job. Here's a little wet fly. I'm going to try some of these for trout this year. There's another really nice hopper. Another woolly bucker variant. Actually, the, the trout and the slough have been really liking white. I might just give that a toss, see what they do. I bet that'll work really well. There's another little nymph. Got a lot of bugs. Wow. 
There's another little nymph. He does just excellent work. I really like these. Really, really like these. A nice little streamer. I love the soft tackle. Another little uh, hopper variant. Man, he did a, he did a really good job. I really like these little crayfish. The carp where I'm at really likes small. Oh, well, he cut those out out of a. Uh, looks like a. canvas. That's a really good idea. The carp I fish for around here like the little crayfish, like them really small. And I bet that'll be a really good one. Sent me some more of those little white soft tackles. And I bet those will be killer for the trout I like to fish for. And panfish. And bass. I bet the little I bet the bluegills will love those. I mean, he gave me a full frickin' handful. I love these little nymphs and little wets. If you know me, I mainly fish nymphs, wets, and streamers, anything subsurface. But I'll occasionally fish topwater. I really like that. That'll be a nice little, little dead drifter. Pretty cool little one there. There's a little Copper John variant right there. Or Brassy. This is a Brassy, actually. There's a Brassy. He does excellent work, like I said. I think he can tie up pretty much anything you want. All you gotta do is ask. I think I've shown all the different ones in here but I'm gonna put them all in my hand show you all what he sent me that's just one little box one little bag he sent and there's still more to go Ooh, I like this. I bet this will be good. He sent me a lot of test flies, and I'll have to figure out the names of what he calls them. I really like that. I bet that'll be killer out there. Nice little, nice little streamer wet fly. Woolly booger variant. I really like that. Here's another one, Narc Test. I know what these are. These are black nosed dices. They're tied really small, too. I really like that. It's a lot it's smaller than I tie them, but I normally tie them, but I really like that. The way he did them. I'm gonna get the bag open. I like dices. I've never tied them this small, but I bet this will be freaking wicked. Little black nosed dice. Here's another one marked test. Little bags are hard to open. I plan to test all these out, every last one. Oh, I really like that. It's a sinking spider. Little sinking spider variant. Oh, I love it. That's pretty awesome. Actually, I bet, due to the little rubber legs, I bet this would pass off as a a dragonfly nymph. A little dragonfly nymph, and I bet the carp where I like to go carping will suck that right up. I can't wait to give that a try. I really like it.
<clears throat> Alright, gave me some midges, some little, uh, looks like, uh, hot spot pheasant tails. See if I can get it open. It looks like uh, about a 22. No, maybe an 18. Or, yeah, probably an 18. Or 16. No, it's an 18. I'll hook gauge it later. Nice little guy. That's a really, really awesome. Nice little mid nice little midge. Put that on my finger. They're insanely sharp hooks. He sent me another test bag. These look like a dragonfly or damselfly nymphs. And these are incredibly good. I enjoy these, using these little damsel fly nymphs. I bet the I bet the trout would really like it. It's in a nice color, nice flashy color. I may have to uh, give that a pitch on my next little outing for trout. And I bet the panfish will love it too. I really do. He gave me a lot of bugs. A lot of bugs. Here's another uh, little wet fly. I'm not quite sure the name of it. I'll have to look it up, but he did an awesome job. I love soft hackle. I love hackle in general. I love that little little uh, chartreuse hot spot back there. I bet this will be a great little pattern. And he gave me a bunch of variants of the Chernobyl ant that are really cool. Did an excellent job. Again, smaller than I tie, but really nice looking. I really like that. About a size 14. And then another uh, another bag of uh, looks like a mixed bag of hopper and a Chernobyl ant variant. In fact, I'm gonna pull this one out. I like it. I really like it, actually. I like deer hair. Come on now, get out of there. That's a pretty cool Chernobyl ant variant right there. It's more of a hopper than a Chernobyl ant, but really, really cool. I'm sure that'll catch some fish. A couple of the Chernobyl ants he sent over. One with uh, high vis. One without. Sent him in all kinds of colors. I really like the colors he sent. The natural tan and yellow hopper color. The tan and brown hopper. I must say thank you very much, Mr. Jonathan, for all these flies you sent. I'll be testing them all out. and I really recommend you guys give him a check out. Uh, his uh his fly shop is uh Brimores. You can like his page on Facebook and he's just a great tire. I'd highly recommend you uh pick some bugs up from him and I'll be testing all these out, giving them a try, seeing what I like and what I works best for me. I don't think there's any of these that won't work. And I'm really looking forward to trying them out. Well, everybody, I hope you have a great day. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you'll stay tuned to watching me test these out. Give them a try. I'll try them on the trout. I'll try them on the panfish and the bass. And we're just going to have a lot of fun doing it. I hope you have a great day and tight lines on your next fishing adventure.